It's currently 10.08 p.m. And this is where I'm at currently on uh, the polystrain drawing for a prop character that's going to be in the 99 Dan Hamming episode. And I'm just about done with the front and this side. All I have left to do on those sides are the details for the boots. So before I do that, I'm currently working on getting this side done. And I finished this arm sleeve of the denim jacket and uh, this line. His dad was cooking... some cheeseburgers with some crushed red pepper and a bit of steak sauce beneath the burger. I got some applesauce and crunchy ch Cheetos. It's a knockoff brand. But they're basically Cheetos. I recall waking up maybe around 9, 9.15 in the morning, and it was around, oh wait, it was actually more around 8 in the morning that I got up for today and around 9.30 in the morning I had some granola cereal with pretty much the last of the milk we had at the time and so later We first went to uh, the DMV at the mall uh, to ask about uh, getting my driver's permit renewed. We, uh, I got one of these at that DMV office. So I could study. And take. An online test. Which I, in order to pass. I need a score of 70%. Uh, thankfully, we didn't really have to wait in order to ask about renewing my permit. I think you just get at least a 70% uh, print off
the passing test result and then give it to the DMV later on. The dad cooked these burgers. Yeah, most likely on our stove. Pan on our stove. Yeah, they turned out to be pretty good. After our brief stop at uh, the DMV. And we went to uh, the local Aldi's for that area and got most of our groceries there. Uh, which I believe included, uh, which included the beef patties. And some buns Dad used for uh, these cheeseburgers. as well as some more of those plain bagels. That I enjoyed the other day. And that first Aldi's we went to, we couldn't find any of the uh, microwavable slash cookable egg rolls. Uh, so... Dan and I instead decided to get from the same brand their chicken lo mein bag though Dad was able to spot a box of their chicken egg rolls As well as a box of toasted ravioli belonging to a different brand at, at another Aldi's. And uh, those two things consisted of what I had for lunch around 4.30 p.m. Yeah, but we got most of our groceries for today. Most of the groceries we got today, I mean. Everything we got from those two Aldi's locations. We'll probably be, be eaten over more than a week. We got most of our groceries from the first Aldi's location we went to, and then the second, we basically just got a few items. And that second Aldi's, I, I, if I recall correctly, was more towards the area of Dad's house.
If I recall correctly, I believe I mostly worked on you know, the polystyrene drawing. Within the last couple of hours. And when I got back. From the DMV and our Aldi shopping at two different locations. I did some reading into that driver's manual that I got from the DMV. Not really with the intention of deliberately studying, but just kind of looking into it. Kind of in order to let myself know, you know what I needed to study. I believe we got back If I recall, it was around 2.30 p.m. when we got back. We left around 1.30 p.m. Although I and before we went to the mall GMV, we briefly stopped at Mom's place. I recall spending my morning hours uh, mostly doing things on either Incremental Epic Hero 2 or Queen's Blade Limit Break and maybe a bit of this game too. And then there was a period in the late afternoon evening period in which I didn't do too much either. Uh, during the late morning, early afternoon period, uh, I recall using some of my epic coins that I got from Daily Chess in, in Incremental Epic Hero 2 uh, to buy 10 inventory slots because I was running out of free by that point, I was out of free inventory slots because I like having one of each unique item in my inventory slots. If I recall correctly, it cost me 5,000 epic coins, which I all got from free uh, daily chess in that game. 
uncongregate. 